Hello friends, welcome back to Multi Question World. Today we are going to discuss important questions from Clinical Pathology Part 4 RRB and Blood Bank Technology. Question number 1. Ben Stone's protein coagulates at the temperature option A 80 to 90 degrees Celsius, option B 45 to 55 degrees Celsius, option C 90 to 100 degrees Celsius, option D 30 to 40 degrees Celsius. The right answer is option B, 45 to 55 degrees Celsius. Benstone's protein which is seen in multiple myeloma coagulates at 45 to 55 degrees Celsius. Question number 2. Percentage of acetic acid used in heat and acetic acid test. Option A, 33%. Option B, 10%. Option C, 3%. Option D, 12%. The right answer is option C, 3%. Acetic acid used in heat and acetic acid test is 3%. Question number 3. Glomerular filtration rate. Option A, 127 ml per minute. Option B, 100 ml per minute. Option C, 130 ml per minute. Option D, 160 ml per minute. The right answer is option A, 127 ml per minute. Normal GFR is 127 ml per minute. Question number 4. Rothra's nitroprusside test is a qualitative test for option A, bilirubin, option B, bile salt, option C, ketone bodies, option D, urobilinogen. Rothra's nitroprusside test is used for option C ketone bodies the right answer is option C ketone bodies question number 5 percentage of acetic acid used for acidifying urine in Fouchet's test option A 10 percentage option B 3 percentage option C 18 percentage option D 33 percentage The right answer is option D, 33%. 33% acetic acid is used for acidifying urine in Fouchet's test. Question number 6. Urobilinogen in urine is detected by option A, Rothra's test, option B, Ehrlich test, option C, Valle's diamond quick screen method, option D, both B and C. The right answer is option D, both B and C. Ehrlich test and Valle's diamond quick screen method is used for urobilinogen in urine. Question number 7. Ehrlich reagent contains option A, tetramethyl paraphenylene diamine dihydrochloride, option B, 4 aminophenazone, option C, paradimethyl aminobenzaldehyde, option D, both A and C. The right answer is option C, paradimethyl aminobenzaldehyde. Ehrlich reagent contains PDAB or paradimethyl aminobenzaldehyde. Question number 8. Watson Schwartz test is done in urine to detect option A, porphobilinogen, option B, urobilinogen, option C, bilirubin, option D, both A and B. The right answer is option A, porphobilinogen. watson Schwartz test is done in urine to detect porphobilinogen. Question number 9. Cast in urine are indicative of option A, homocysteinuria, option B, ketonuria, option C, proteinuria, option D, hemoglobinuria. The right answer is option C, proteinuria. Cast in urine are indicative of proteinuria. Question 
क्वेश्चन नंबर टेन डम्बिल शेप क्रिस्टल्स आर कैरेक्टरिस्टिक फीचर ऑफ ऑप्शन ए कैल्शियम ऑक्सीलेट ऑप्शन बी कैल्शियम कार्बोनेट ऑप्शन सी कैल्शियम फोस्फेट ऑप्शन डी बोथ ए एंड बी द राइट आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी बोथ ए एंड बी कैल्शियम ऑक्सीलेट इज डम्बल शेप क्रिस्टल एंड ऑल्सो ऑफर्ड कैल्शियम कार्बोनेट इज सीन एज डम्बल शेप क्वेश्चन नंबर लेवन स्पेसिफिक ग्राविटी ऑफ यूरिन कैन बी डिटेक्टेड बाय ऑप्शन ए रिफ्रैक्टोमेट्रिक मेथड ऑप्शन बी यूरिनोमेट्रिक मेथड ऑप्शन सी स्ट्रिप मेथड ऑप्शन डी ऑल ऑफ द एबो The right answer is option D, all of the above. Refractometer, urinometer, and strip method is used for the detection of specific gravity of urine. Question number twelve. Caffeine lid shaped crystals seen in urine. Option A, calcium oxalate. Option B, triple phosphate. Option C, uric acid. Option D, calcium carbonate. The right answer is option B, triple phosphate. Caffeine lid shaped crystal is triple phosphate. Question number thirteen. Normal total protein content in cerebrospinal fluid. Option A forty to eighty milligram per dl. Option B fifteen to forty five milligram per dl. Option C hundred milligram per dl. Option D forty five to ninety milligram per dl. The right answer is option B. Fifteen to forty-five milligram per dl. Normal total protein content in CSF is fifteen to forty-five milligram per dl. Question number fourteen. Increased white cell count in CSF. Option A. Pleocytosis. Option B. Monocytosis. Option C. Lymphocytosis. Option D. Pancytosis. The right answer is option A. Pleocytosis. Increased white cell count in CSF is known as pleocytosis. Question number fifteen. Pandy's test is done for option A. Glucose in CSF. Option B. Globulin in urine. Option C. Globulin in CSF. Option D. Glucose in urine. The right answer is option C. Globulin in CSF. Pandy's test is done for globulin in CSF. Today we are winding up. You can watch the previous videos from playlist. And if you are watching with or subscribing, please do subscribe. Thank you.